Good morning. It's 10 a.m. on Thursday, December 26th, 2019. And I'm Christiana Ellis, and I sound like this this morning. This is five more minutes. So the plan was that I was going to go into work today, but I feel terrible. So. <clears throat> Incidentally, this is already after me trying to drink tea to improve this. So, <laughs> um, I tried to go to bed at a reasonable hour last night, but I just had the worst time trying to get to sleep last night. And I'm just not feeling good this morning. And my alarm went off, and I was starting to try to drag myself out of bed despite how terrible I felt. And then there was a moment of clarity where I said, what the hell am I doing? And I went back to bed because nobody cares. <laughs> I mean, the only reason, I, so, like, I didn't have anything that absolutely needed to be done in the office today, and so it was really mostly me going in so that I didn't have to take another vacation day, but I can work around that. I can, I can make that up another way. So just because it was my original plan doesn't mean I need to stick to it even when I'm clearly sick. That's called... Adaptability. I hope everyone had a happy December 25th, whether you celebrate it as Christmas or as just a Wednesday. Mine was pretty good, except for being sick. I watched more of this season, the new season of The Expanse. And I'm enjoying it so far, although it feels weirdly smaller in scale compared to the previous seasons and that might be because it absolutely is because it's changed networks and it's the whole different setup I don't know I'm enjoying it anyway I like it um, but yeah um, that's pretty good and I played a bunch more Death Stranding where I'm starting to get a, a handle now on like now that you know it's not just all set up, like what is the actual game kind of like, and I kind of dig it. It's very weird. <clears throat> um, it consists primarily of a lot of things that normally, out of context, you would say sound boring or dumb, but kind of work for me. Like, the landscapes are beautiful. You spend a lot of time in them. The enemies are very scary and even when you start getting gear that allows you to deal with them a little bit more it's always stressful anytime you have to go somewhere where they are and it's just fun I'm, I'm, I want to keep playing it um, I was thinking I might stream some more of it but I don't really want to subject people to this or for that matter, I don't want to talk for three hours and have this just get worse, which it would. Instead, I'm going to drink tea, rest up, sleep some more. Hopefully, I will be back on the upswing by tomorrow. <sighs> what are you going to do? Sometimes you get sick. Um, but yeah, like... Uh, I don't know what what else should I talk about. <laughs> um, I've been continuing to think about puppy names. I don't have any like I I'm I'm not going to choose a final one until um, until I get to meet the little the little fella. But I've been thinking about it and trying to decide. You know, there there are various sort of paths that you can take to choosing a dog name, right? Like, but, you know, criteria for me include something that's kind of easy to say in a variety of contexts, right? Um, and obviously, you know, if you repeat something frequently, it becomes easier to say. But I guess what, what I just mean is if you can't, if you can't imagine shouting a name across the dog park to get your dog to come to you, then maybe not the best dog name. 
you want something uh, like what I've read is that two syllable words with the end with a uh, like a, a vowel sound are good um, now that doesn't mean that the word has to actually end with a vowel but it just means that like for example Luna met those criteria you know Luna because you can hold it out right and and just in terms of it being easy for the dogs to remember and recognize that word. But I also want it to have some pleasant association for me. So I'm just continuing to think about it. Um, I will certainly update you guys when I've made a final decision. But in the meantime, I'm going to talk to you tomorrow for five more minutes and then go back to resting my voice.